I smell snow. Well, hey guys, I feel like it's been a while since we've chatted. My internet is slow and it is not uploading my vlogs like I had hoped. When I was at my sister's house, she had such fast internet that I could upload a video in an hour. Um, my last vlog took me two days. I'm working on a collab right now with some other YouTube gals and it's taken me two days to upload an eight minute video. Ridiculous. And so I'm filming. They're coming. Like I'm going to have Shane call tonight, uh, the internet provider, because we've had this issue happen before. And when he calls, he kind of gets stuff done um, because they we've called before and they say there's no problem or there's just something wrong in the area and that it should be fixed, but it never does get fixed. So then he calls and he's puts on his mean pants, I guess. I don't know. And he gets stuff done. Um, and so it was really fast for a while there. Now, now we're back to like trickle, slow internet. Like my phone isn't even working. Um, so that's kind of the level that we're at. Anyways, it snowed. Oh my goodness. Um, and it snowed a lot. Last night I worked on getting the outside of my house done. Um, I had been trying to put up garland for at least two weeks now. Um, when we lived here prior to our renovation, I could just tack the garland right onto the uh, walls of the house because they were wood. It was like wood siding or whatever. Now it's vinyl siding. And so I needed different um, hooks to attach to the door frame. And what I had wasn't working as good as maybe just using plain old command hooks or something like that. Uh, and so it took a while and then I'm short and trying to get the garland like up above and around the door It just ugh. but finally I got it done and it looks so pretty. I'm hoping to share with you a photo tonight of it um, But anyways yesterday the ground was bare. It was grass. It was green um, And then it snowed in the night and it is a winter wonderland outside. So it's really exciting um, and one of the awesome things was is that Yesterday, the kids spent time uh, with their grandma, and Aubrey had a birthday party to go to, and then they also had Shane's work Christmas party, and he always takes them uh, his, himself, usually. Um, and so I just got the afternoon to myself. I finished decorating all of my house. There were some spots I just didn't know what to do with yet, and um, I, I completed it. I finished it and it feels so good. I was on Instagram this morning and I follow a ton of decor accounts on Instagram. Um, and someone was posting about she was so sick of her Christmas decor already. She's had it up since November 12th because she had um, obligations with companies and work and stuff to like have early decor so it can be, I don't know. In magazines, advertisement, who knows, pictures, whatever. Um, anyways, and looking at the comments, there were 54 comments, and a lot of them were saying, oh, it's so beautiful, but there were several that were saying, yeah, I'm so sick of mine too, can't wait to take it all down, and I thought, oh, that's so sad to me on so many levels, because this is the Christmas season now, um, and I don't know. Personally, I would love to have my decor up that early, and I would probably love it for a couple months. <laughs> um, but I'm just, I'm glad I, it came together for me when it did, so that I, I don't get tired of it. Um, so anyways, I'm going to try and film my decor tour th today. It's bright out, um, and I feel like I can do it. It's a lot. That's, I guess that's. Part of the thing is just it's a lot, and so it'll take a chunk out of my day, and it'll take a chunk to to edit it all, but I want to share with you, so I'm going to get that done. Let's see. Some back there. I decorate my whole home, like everything. Um, someday I want to even be even more than what I have. Like I would love garlands around the doorways and just every nook and cranny decorated tastefully but beautifully. Um, so I'm doing that with what I got. I think I put out... A good majority of my decorations so um, oh I meant to tell you what I was trying to say rabbit trail um, 
Aubrey's grandparents, the kids' grandparents came and picked Aubrey up for school today, which was the biggest blessing ever. Um, because they were with uh, my mother-in-law yesterday, Colt's car seat got taken out of the car, and I can't put his car seat in well. Um, Shane does it so good, like it is solid. He should be a car seat technician. It is so good. Um, and so my mother-in-law just randomly messaged me and asked me if she wanted, if she could take Aubrey to school. And I was like, yeah, that'd be great because that just means I don't have to go out in the morning. Um, and so she and my father-in-law came over and it was the blessing because Shane wasn't able to put Colt's car seat in before he left for work. So um, with the weather, I didn't have to worry. And I get to be home all day, which is so exciting. And then tonight, um, my mother-in-law is coming back over with my sister-in-law, and we are going to watch the Christmas movie that was filmed here in the summer. So there are lots of Hallmark movies that are filmed in my, in my city, and it's really cool to kind of go and watch them and see where Chicago is really our city and stuff like that. Um, but anyways, James Brolin filmed a Christmas movie here this summer and we're gonna watch it tonight so I'm gonna make a, some snacks and it's gonna be good I'm really really excited so anyways that's a peek at our day Colt is in the bathtub he has been loving going in during like the late morning and playing in the water so more power to him I've got some laundry to fold and I'm gonna start filming my decor so I've got this gooseberry patch cookbook the old-fashioned country Christmas um, and I'm just kind of going through it to see if there is an appetizer that I want to make tonight for our movie I am thinking I might make uh, this three cheese dip from Epicure but I'm going to see if there's another something in here that might be good I don't have a whole lot of ingredients on hand I really need to get groceries but um, Shane has said that he would stop off at the grocery store for me tonight. Ooh, peppermint hot chocolate. Hmm. Interesting. It has peppermint schnapps. I don't drink anything except like water. You know, like I don't, I don't drink alcohol. So, hmm. so anyways, I'm gonna go through this and ooh, see if there's anything that would be good. There's all the eggs. Let's see if they'll hatch. Hello. Do you, do you want them out? Hello. Oh, you have another one. Sorry. 20. 20 little dino eggs. There. Let's put them right here.
The kids are watching Frosty with their Auntie Sarah, and I am out in the kitchen getting the dishes done. Shane should be home, I don't know, the next half hour, 45 minutes. He had to stop at the grocery store to pick me up a couple things for tonight, and the babies will go to bed, and then we'll watch a movie. threw together this really quick dip in my um, KitchenAid mixer just took a couple minutes to put together. It's cream cheese, a cup of marble cheese, you could do half a cup cheddar, half a cup of um, mozzarella, and then um, half a cup of mayonnaise, and then a tablespoon of each of three different Epicure spices. I'll leave the link to this recipe down below. So. I'm going to throw this in the oven and we are going to have some snacks and watch our movie. <laughs> 